Hello. Uh, I'm going to show you how uh, my showcase uh, poems, uh, openbadges.me, um, issues badges to individuals. How those individuals can uh, receive their badges uh, by email or by their openbadges.me backpack, uh, just to demonstrate the, the issuing process so that we can hopefully uh, demonstrate conformance to the IMS open badges to zero. Um, issuing standard. Uh, I'll begin first of all by signing into a, an administrative uh, account for uh, open badges. What I'll do inside here is I'll issue a badge to an example. So if I go into here, there's different ways in which we can issue badges from, uh, from openbadges.me. We can issue them via email, we can issue them via imported file or by user groups. We have APIs which allow badges to be issued and we also have a rules-based process issue process that allows, based upon activity and events recorded, badges to be automatically issued. For the demonstration of this, I'll just take the simplest approach, which will be to issue a badge manually. So let's say I choose this particular badge here and I want to issue it. I select issue badge. It takes me to an uh, issuing field. I say who I want to issue that badge to. I put in the email address of the person I want to issue that badge to. I add that recipient. The recipient's been added. And now I simply go ahead and issue that badge. I confirm that I want to issue that badge. I get confirmation that it's issuing the badge and baking it. So now it's just building that center for issuing, just waiting for it to be issued and to be issued while that's going on. Now, the badge has been issued now. Uh, what I can do is I now will sign out of here and I'll sign in as the individual and I'll also go to the individual's email account to show you how that badge has been actually issued to them and how they can retrieve it. So first of all, I'm going to the email account. So I'll have a look at here. I can see here that in terms of this, that there's been a badge sent out to me. Congratulations, you've been issued the following badge. Here's the badge. They invite me to download it. So if I wanted to, I could just simply download the badge. And here's the badge for me. And I can actually then save that. So if I went to file and actually a copy of that, and I put it away into my kind of library of badges. If I go in now and paste that into there, and I've just got that badge now. So now I could have loaded that into any backpack and there's a layer on the badge passport, etc. So I could load that badge up. Equally, if I now go back to this environment, if I sign in as the individual, if that individual has been through the badges, go and open badges.me backpack. When I go into here and I sign in as an individual backpack owner, and I sign in here, what I'll see is I'll see the badges which have been issued to me once it loads it up. And I can actually see that one of the badges that's automatically been put into my backpack is this one. And this one is, uh, I'll put it in greater detail. I can go on a little bit of detail for this. I can see in its uh, description, the issuer, the criteria which has been burned, any other details on there. I have the option to download it from here. Or I can share it as a, a link on social media or anything like that. Or I can delete it. I can add comments to it describing my badge. And so the badge is automatically put into um, the, the person, the recipients, open badges stop me. Backpack. If they haven't received it, as I've demonstrated, if they don't have an open badges W backpack, what they do get is the uh, email to actually tell them, as I've showed you, the email which shows who the open badges is. So there's the, the email confirmation that they received that badge. Um, another way that then they can actually display the badges is their badges which have been issued by open badges .me. If I wanted to, and I go into this particular environment, I go back down to the graphic view now, 
I could actually manually upload a badge into my backpack and display it that way. Uh, so, so if I go in and actually add my badge, I go to upload a badge. So my badge has been downloaded from the, uh, the email which I received, or it could have been actually downloaded from my open badges document backpack into this particular folder. So I'm not going to choose a different badge. So say I choose this particular badge and I open that, I upload that badge. What that will do is that will take that badge, it will upload it into my area and I can then start to just review it. So I can go in, I can take a different view of that. So I can see it's been issued and the criteria, etc. So as you can see, there's different ways in which the individual can actually retrieve and start to use their badges. They can be issued uh, uh, directly into their openbadges.me backpack or via email so they can download the badges and they can upload them into any applicable uh, open badges 2.0 uh, backpack. Uh, and that's it. Thank you.